Near sellout crowd here at the Portland Sports Arena tonight, and I can almost come as close to uh, guaranteeing as you ever can guarantee anything in this business that there'll probably be some people turned away Tuesday night. I hope you won't be one of them. Get your tickets early. The only way to get tickets, Sandy Bar's Flea Market. Tomorrow, come out, go to the concession stand, or call Sunday or Tuesday. And no one will be answering the phone on Monday, Sunday or Tuesday, 289-4222. 289-4222. Ed Wyskowski, the partner of Buddy Rose, up in the ring with him this time. He did not come out with him during the introductions. And Lonnie Main was actually trying to talk one of the security policemen out of his billy club down here. He was trying to talk him out of his nightstick. He did get a cane. He got a cane. He didn't get the nightstick. Consulting referees after him, and Lonnie's got another cane. Sandy Bar trying to take that one away from him. First ball in about a time of uh, 13 seconds. Ed Wyskowski still down at ringside in Rose's corner. The bell is rung. He's counting on him to get into the ring. The count of 20 has started. Lonnie goes over and stops the count. He said, don't count on him. Get him in the ring. But I don't want him counted out. I want to get that guy in the ring. Get physical with him. Stop the count again. The count goes to 20. If a man. Uh, I'm listening to the to Sai making an announcement about a lady who has to get out of the parking lot. Now finally rose in the ring. Wiskowski still at ringside. And Wiskowski on the arena floor. Down near Buddy Rose's corner. Rose went for a kick to the midsection of the Moondog. Maine and Maine grabbed the leg. And that's the one with a bad knee. And pulled hamstring also. He went after the hamstring that time. Lonnie Moondog Maine. A number of years ago, and I think it might have been down at the Armory. I can't remember for sure where the street fight was invented. Maine's invention, and Buddy Rose would give it a try against the man who invented it, the king of the street fights, Moondog Maine. For years before that, I think people, some people thought about it. Nobody was quite crazy enough, wild enough to try it, and that can never be said about anything. In the case of the Moondog, watch out, Wyskowski coming up on the apron. And now, Wyskowski gets him. Barr saved uh, Rose from getting him. Barr saved Rose from getting him. But the blood's flowing. He got him on the turnbuckle, Wyskowski. Well, Sandy Barr was pushing Rose away. Good shot of it. On your screen right now, the blood is flowing. Wyskowski slammed the head of Lonnie Main into the turnbuckle in behind it, right on the middle part. First ball in this main event, and a wild one it is. Right cross by Moondog Main. Staggers Rose. Rose comes after, double thumb gouge into the eyes. The blood is flowing, bad cut from that turnbuckle. 
Turnbuckles, what was used to put a number of cuts in Jay Youngblood's arm last Saturday. Turnbuckle treatment. A face, but a crimson mask already. And Rose trying to get even more blood by biting and main back, biting his own, on his own. Blood on the referee, blood on Rose, and it's all Lonnie Main's blood at this point. If Lonnie has his way, Rose will get up. Put a little blood into this thing, too. They are both groggy and colliding in the middle of the ring. Over the top rope. Choking Rose, working on Maine. Remember, Maine won the first fall before Rose even got his robe off. And the circulation being cut off of Lonnie's arms, you see them go white as his arms are tied up in those top two ropes. Rose working on him. Here he comes flying across the ring, his shoulder driven into the midsection on Lonnie Mean. Crashing to the concrete floor. Backwards, out of the ring, down on the cement floor. And this one's with rules. Think of these guys wearing cowboy boots, western boots into the ring. No rules. Watch out from behind, Rose, coming up behind me. Regular rules in effect tonight in this match. Lonnie Moondog Mean, a bloody mess at this point. Rose has him hurt. And a sneak attack from behind by Ed Wyskowski that you saw on your cameras. Sandy Barr was busy with Rose. Shoulder throw, Mean down hard, elbow drop. And another. Main in trouble. Foot stop to that cut. Knee drop to that cut. A full house crowd yelling, we want Lonnie. Elbow smash right on that cut. Right on the forehead. And an elbow drop to it. Covers him with a body press. One, two, and three. And this match, and I'll tell you if anything could ever be called a grudge match, this one is all even at a fall of peace with a leg drop after the bell to the left arm of Lonnie Mean. Lonnie holding his shoulder, bleeding from his forehead. And you see Buddy Rose yelling up here. I was going to say yelling at yours truly, which reminds me, while we wait for this match to continue. Yours truly, Frank Bonima, is going to be, uh, make a note on your card, please, in about a month. On a Sunday, November 6th, I'll be in Chehalis. Cards start at 7 o'clock. And I will be there as your ring announcer. Big five match card, Chehalis, Washington. I'll be your announcer. So, uh, guest announcer at Chehalis on the 6th of November. Right now, Tom Peterson and I, once again, going with our tag team to tell you about Please Surprise. We'll be back in just a moment. Hello, I'm Tom Peterson, and here's the lowest price we've ever offered on an Admiral full-size freezer. Only $299. Yes, only $299, or $15 a month if you prefer terms. And it holds over 500 pounds of frozen food. 15.8 cubic feet of storage area. And best of all, you can buy it for only $15 a month. That's right, only $15 a month. Now that's Tom Peterson's. Admiral's the name, a name you know, Admiral. 16 foot, 15.8, I think, uh, cubic foot freezer for $299. One of those Tom uh, has told you about. 
I want to call your attention to it, the fact that it's Admiral, the fact that it's a great fight. But more than anything else, I want to tell you that Freeze their headquarters for the Pacific Northwest right here in Oregon, Tom Peterson's. All shapes, all sizes, all models at Tom Peterson's, Southeast 82nd Foster.